I went to Starbucks to get me a pink drink. I pull up to the window. She says, hi, how you doing? What do you want? And I was like, okay, we know each other like that. She was a little sassy with me to start, okay? So at first she got me flustered. My body doesn't really go into fight or flight mode. It kind of just continuously asks if it should go into fight or flight mode, okay? It's indecisive. So I have no idea if I want to just speed through the drive-thru or punch her in the face. I don't see there's two, they're very different. Like which one is going to work better in my situation, know what I mean? Which I would never, I don't hit women, okay? Or men. I am too small to initiate. I've been to Starbucks before so I know how this goes, okay? She's going to lean out and she's going to ask me for my preferred payment options. I, not ever having cash on me, am going to hand her my credit card, okay? But now, since Mm, COVID. I can't just hand her my credit card because she won't take it. And I understand. I don't want to touch other people's dirty old crusty finger credit cards. I don't know where it's been. I don't know what you're swiping for, your dirty transactions. I don't want that either. So if you could just be so kind as to just lay down the little keypad thing and I'll just stick my credit card in, we'll call it a day. Charge it. It's not what they do. Starbucks don't do that no more. Starbucks wants to make you look stupid. And they do. So she picks up the card reader and hands it at me. Not to me. I wasn't allowed to touch it at me. So now all I have to do is grab my credit card and stick it in the slot. That's it. You do that, you get your drink, you go home. But what she don't know is that I was already flustered from her sass in the beginning. I thought she wanted to throw hands, so my hands are already shaking. Shut up. You've never had a vibrating punch? It hurts way worse. So I grab my card and I go to stick it into the slot, which I can normally do on my own when the card reader's not also moving. I have pretty good hand-eye coordination when it's my eyes. <laughs> She's holding the card reader like this, so now I have to calculate for her movements. It may take two to tango, but it only takes one of you to put that down so I can stick my card in there and take my drink and go, okay? So now I just have a line of people behind me that can only see an arm sticking out of a window, trying its best <laughs> to stick it into the slot and definitely not getting it the first couple tries. Now, you, you, have to, you have to move yours at none, and then I will put it in. Nope. I ended up doing that thing where you just like smack it on the top and you just sl drag it down till you reach it and then shove it in. That didn't work. I'm just confidently shoving it not in the hole. <laughs> do you take Bitcoin? I just want to ask for help, but I don't know how to do that. I'm nervous. I'm still riled up and ready to get rowdy if need be. So I asked her, hey, can you help me get it in there? <laughs> I heard it right when I said it. That's typically how words work. Milady, I request assistance. My card's just bumping off the rubber on the top and bottom of the card reader. I'm at a 45 degree angle, you're flatlined. I, we're not gonna make it this way. At this point, I'd have better luck shoving a square block in a circle hole, which I mean, if you force it hard enough, that's gonna work, which was kind of my mentality with this. So I just go more aggressive. <laughs> Let me pay you. I'm built different. <laughs> at this point, I'm just poking and hitting the parts of the card reader that won't accept my card for so long that she is now forced to have to take more orders. So I'm still doing this. And she says, how can I help you? I knew she wasn't talking to me, which is why I had to beg myself not to respond to her. You could help me by taking my card. Now, I don't know how long that took, but I know it took long enough for us to understand each other's movements. <laughs> I've been here long enough to know that when I dodge, she's gonna weave. And when she ducks, I'm gonna dodge. The people behind me just started clapping, okay? Honking their horns. They made banners. Babies were made in my name. It was a joyous occasion. Y'all do not get paid enough to deal with people like me. I had to take the drive of shame. I took my shoes off and everything. <laughs> I'll be back tomorrow. But before I I left she made eye contact with me okay as if to say I can't wait to tell everyone I know about this no worries I'll do it for you which is actually something I wish you would have said when I was playing bumper cards with my card and your card reader 